of Duty XP is all about celebrating the consumer, celebrating the people who love our brand, and they love every little detail. I think every once in a while you need to humanize the brand in a way where you're actually on the fans level. You bring them, you invite them, and you're with them, and I think that's important for us. Historically, we've done a huge multiplayer event. We would do COD Champs and it would be a big thing, or we would do XP and it was a huge thing. This year, we decided to do all three at once. Welcome to Call of Duty XP 2016! The beauty of being able to do the multiplayer briefing is that this is really what kicks off their first look at the games. The fan reaction's been awesome. People jumping up and down screaming for it. We're really excited to finally be out there and finally be public with everything. The community is really loving what we're doing. They're liking, they're sharing, and it's spreading it even beyond what we can do on our own channel. The most important thing here is you get your hands on the game. Fans being able to play zombies, fans being able to play Modern Warfare Remastered. We have our first virtual reality experience on PlayStation VR, and obviously our new release with Infinite Warfare is super critical. We've set a new bar with this year's Call of Duty XP. There was a tremendous amount of coordination to bring these activities to life. We've got a zip line, juggernaut cage fighting, paintball on a live Nuketown map. We've got zombies in Spaceland laser tag. The masses that we're reaching this weekend, the experiences that we're bringing people, it's unmatched not only in the video game industry, but also I think in entire event production. Being able to do champs within uh, XP has been pretty awesome and we've had over a thousand teams competing for a slot here and now they're just here to see who's the best team on the planet. It's pretty exciting. One of the things that we came up with this year was with the XP zone. This has never been done before in esports because it's a way to bring an entire event with matches that are happening simultaneously to anyone who wasn't able to come to XP. We're seeing just the most incredible broadcast and the most incredible production taking place. You know, it's been a, an amazing year and I can't wait for, for 2017 already. We always set a high bar for ourselves and I think we pull off things that other teams couldn't do. We were able to utilize the passionate fan base that we have and turn this event into a massive marketing push with unrivaled enthusiasm. All the content that we created and all the content that our influencers made as a result really was able to extend our reach beyond anything that we could do on our own.